Hi everybody, I am Lorenzo from lorenzcapital.com and today I want to show you how to animate objects along a spline in uh, Cinema 4D. Let's create a new sweep nerves. Then let's create a new rectangle. Set the rectangle sides with, for example, 4 by 4. Then let's create a new helix. Then, then select these objects and drag and drop into the sweep nerves. Set, let's go to the helix menu and set start radius by 250 and radius by 205 and in angle by 715 degrees then set radial bias by 35 percent height by 1516 And then let's go to the MoGraph menu and set Cloner and let's create a new cube. Then set the cube size, for example, 80 by 80 by 18. Now right click and set simulation text, set rigid body and set individual elements, set all, and force, follow position 2 and follow rotation 2, then copy and change the cube sides and increase the sides, for example 125, then copy again and change the size of the cube, for example, 150. Okay, now select these cubes and drag and drop into the cloner. Let's go to the cloner menu and set mood object. Then select helix and drag and drop into the object tab. Okay, now select the count by 250. Then set seconds by 20. And set zero keyframe. Set 100% and add a new keyframe and set 20 seconds and 0% and add a new keyframe again. Okay, now cloner selected, let's go to the MoGraph menu, Effector, and set Random Effector. Then, set Position by 25, by 25 and 25, Jack Scale, and Jack Uniform Scale, let's get Scale negative 2, and Rotation by RH, for example, 14 D. 14 degrees, RP 15 degrees and RB 25 degrees.
Then let's create a new material. Set color like yellow and luminance like blue. Then let's create uh, sorry set specular and width by 15 55%. Okay now set a uh, new color again and set color by like uh, uh, blue and luminance by orange for example then let's create a new material set color and Luminance, check luminance. And check specular. Okay, now let's create a new light. And let's create a new plane. Then set the plane sides. Increase this plane and create a new material. Go to the texture gradient and set to the circular. change specular sorry add check luminance then new material and check color and check luminance Ok now let's go to the render settings, set opted by film video and set HDTV, then set frame range or frames, save set quick time movie, then let's go to the if effect menu and set global illumination and ambient occlusion. Set gamma 2.5, 
set low settings then okay now right click simulation text and set collider body on the plane 